everyone, I'm Brenda and welcome to my channel. Recently Bob's Red Mill sent me their gluten-free muffin mix. This is a new mix and I've really been looking forward to trying it. The directions are on the back of the package. I'm just going to make a few minor changes. You can use butter or oil. Add a couple of slightly beaten eggs. I'm replacing the milk with unsweetened almond milk and my son wants orange blueberry muffins so I want to put in a little bit of orange extract. That was my bird clock that you heard chirping away in the background so I'm just using a wooden spoon to mix this up. You can add all types of other ingredients banana nut, lemon blueberry, chocolate cherry, pineapple coconut, orange cranberry, chocolate chips. I'm going to be doing blueberry orange. In the meantime, my oven's been preheated to 400 degrees. Mix your batter until it's well combined. I'm adding the zest of one orange. And they said you can add a cup to a cup and a half of add-ins, so I'm going to do a cup and a quarter of blueberries. I mix those with a little bit of flour so that they don't sink to the bottom. Stir them in. Now we're going to pour this into my prepared muffin tins that I spray with some cooking spray or you can use muffin tin liners. I used my ice cream scoop to help evenly measure out the muffins. I got 12 muffins and I topped them with a little bit of cinnamon and sugar. Now into the oven they go. The muffins took about 25 minutes to bake. I use my digital thermometer, insert it into the center of the muffin when it reaches an internal temperature of 205, the muffins are done. I'm now going to cool them in the pan for five minutes. The muffins easily popped right out of the muffin tins. I'm gonna let them cool a little bit, then I'll slice it in half so you can see what the inside looks like. They smell terrific. Here's the inside of the muffin. It's nice and moist. I can't wait to give it a taste. This muffin is nice and light and moist. It's absolutely delicious. I'll put a link down below to my blog for the recipe. I hope that you can find this muffin mix in your area. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.